Hey guys, welcome to another video. I am back on the same channel but with new custom ROM and new video. In this video, I will show you a full review of the latest unofficial build of Dota OS 5.0 which is based on Android 11. And you can say this one is the almost stable Android 11 custom ROM for our Redmi Note 8. So as you can see here, uh, this one is pretty lagless, bugless and almost stable android 11 rom and you can also use it as your daily driver if you want so in this video i will show you a full review of this rom plus i will also show you how you can install it on your redmi note 8 so without any further ado let's get started <music> So first of all let me show you uh, the bugs of this ROM. There is only two bugs and these bugs are not major bugs. The first one is Bluetooth is not working and this ROM as you can see here it is not working at all. You cannot pair to any audio device or any Bluetooth device as you can see here. Uh, except this one everything is working only the Bluetooth and NFC is on, not working. Uh, except this everything is working fine camera is working you can also install any gcam camera mode like gcam 7.4 from the link in the description every single application and game is working properly the overall performance is also good as you can see here it is opening the apps quickly and the animations are played very well as you can see here it's pretty smooth isn't it, it it's mind-blowing So this one is the almost almost stable Android 11 ROM for our Redmi Note 8 and yes you can use it as your daily driver now, now let's check its gaming performance uh, I am entering the PUBG mobile game uh, let's start a cheer park match And as you can see here the gyrosport is also working the full gyroscope is working fine as you can see here the overall performance is also pretty lagless and glitch free as you can see here the game is working pretty much fine on the default settings and you can also play it on the medium settings it is working fine as you can see here you can also play any other game like asphalt 9 8 call of duty or any other game all other applications are also working fine I have installed all my applications on this ROM uh, as you can see here Facebook, Instagram, YT Studio, PixArt, video editing softwares every single application is working fine and we also have some more options added in the quick settings as you can see here and it comes with the all new features like media uh, play controller for the quick settings as you can see here just play any song and you can control it from the quick settings and if you accidentally remove the notification from the notification then you can get it by extending the uh, quick settings and you can also take the screenshot from the recent applications uh, that switches are really amazing and new features are also coming in the uh, future roams in the settings we have network and internet connected devices and battery the battery performance of this rom is also pretty much awesome and here we have battery saver battery manager and after it we have the display here we have brightness level um, dark theme which is working fine then we have night light which is working fine adaptive brightness you can change its intensity you can change the font sizes and display sizes as you can see here smallest width earth clock screen settings and here we also have the always on display fine but it will drain your battery quickly and in the advanced settings we have ambient display which is working fine then we have double tap to wake which is not working at all as you can see here so you can go without it no issue then you can uh, choose a accent color you can choose a font style and you can also change the app shape 
then we have sound the sound quality of this rom is also pretty much good and then we have storage privacy location security and the security the fingerprint is working fine let me show you as you can see here it is unlocking the device quickly but we don't have the face unlock technology in this rom and the system we have languages and input gestures in the gesture we have quickly open camera and system navigation bar in the system navigation bar we have only a three button navigation bar and system navigation we don't have two button navigation bar then we have power menu options and prevent tricking option and in the power button we have advanced controls like cat controls and other device controls right here and we also have the chat bubbles after it we have date and time backup reset options multiple users developer option and system operator and at the end we have the about phone section from here you can check the droid os uh, dot os logo which is uh, showing and mentioned the droid on time and its android version is 11 android r latest and its security patch is also latest 5 october 2020 so the room is pretty stable and yes it is recommended for daily usage you can use it if you don't care about the NFC and Bluetooth and uh, this room is pretty stable from the previous builds and yes you can use it if you want to install it on your Redmi Note 8 just download this room and gapps from the link in the description and reboot your device into an installed custom recovery You can use any custom recovery like TWRP recovery, Orange Fox or any other recovery but it should be latest and I am using the pitch black recovery, you can also use it and uh, after going into the recovery just simply go to the wipe then go to advanced wipe and from here wipe everything except the internal storage and SD card do not wipe internal storage and SD card just wipe right from here after wiping go back to home click on your install and now locate your downloaded dot os android 11 rom mine is here in the downloads the dot os android r v5.0 just select it and flash it right from here after flashing it go back to install and locate your downloaded gapps for android 11 the nick gapps is recommended you can download it from the link in the description just flash it after flashing if if you want to root your android 11 roms just flash the super user you can download this zip file from the link in the description after flashing these files go to install reboot and, and click on reboot system in a few minutes the rom will be installed on your redmi note 8 so hope you guys like this video if you really did hit the like button don't forget to subscribe my channel keep supporting thanks for watching peace